Good morning, kings and queens. Back out here with you with another one. On here on the beach, enjoying these vibes, these waves, you know what I mean? It's a Friday, so y'all already know. Time to get lit, turned up, and enjoy life. But I came to y'all today, um, had a lot of things on my mind about um, when you know you're about to manifest your dreams or accomplish your goals and elevate, you're gonna start seeing some weird stuff going on. Um, a lot of people in your life is gonna start doing things you just like wh where that come from you know what i'm saying and the reason why that is is because you're about to manifest your goals your, your dreams your the things that you wanted to get accomplished you're about to get accomplished and god is about to bless you you know what i mean if you got people trying to avoid you or not trying to speak to you or whatever it's because they scared of you they scared you might reveal who they really are and who they where their heart really lies because we live in a day and age where everybody's um really being fake man it's hard to find some real ones that's out there with a with a good heart who actually um, trying to do something with their life instead of hate on you or try to compete with you. So that's the main thing I want to tell you. Do not compete with other people. Once you start competing, you fall into their trap. Um, so always, always never kill your vibes over no one. I don't care if it's your mother, your parents, your cousins, who it is, man. Be true to yourself. As long as you're being real to yourself and, being, and, and, and doing what you want to do in life, Nothing else matters, man. No, no, don't, don't even care what they say. What they, they might talk about you 24-7. It might be an aunt, a cousin. You know, they're going to they gonna throw shade on you because they scared of you, bro. They scared. They're intimidated. You know what I mean? But then you got people that's out there supporting you and really there for you. And I want to give a shout-out to all my loved ones, all the ones who um, believed in me to um, get to the point where I'm at now. And I feel I'm just at the beginning of um, my journey of what I want to get accomplished. So, um... Today, I really want to talk about assets. You know what I mean? Assets are very important. And um, yes, real estate, stocks, crypto, land. Land is one of the best assets to have. You know what I'm saying? Um, but the main asset and the most important asset is time. Time is so important. Like, you can't get it back. <laughs> Me talking to y'all right now, I can't even get this time back. You see what I'm saying? It's not all about money. It's not all about, you know, who got the nicest car or who got the nicest jewelry. And yes, I do like nice stuff. I love gold. Because gold is one of the things that um, I feel has the most value than any of the jewelry. I don't, diamonds and all that, I mean, that's cool. But really, diamonds don't got no value. But um, time is the most important asset, man. Ain't nobody really going to tell you that. So that's why it's good to spend time with your loved ones. Spend time with your family. Spend time with people that you really care about, man. Don't wait till they dead to be like... Oh, man, I miss them and drop a tear for them, man. Hey, just call them up. See how they doing. Go visit them. Y'all go get go go get something to eat. Do something. You know what I mean? Go out to the beach. You know, enjoy the good vibes and everything. Get this energy, man. It's all about this energy, man. So, the moral of the story, man, just spend time with your loved ones. Spend time with people that care about you. You know what I'm saying? And, and get rid of them toxic people. Now, a lot of y'all got some toxic people in your life. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The ones always trying to compete with you, nosy. Bro, they nosy. They gonna call and try to figure out what you're doing, like trying to count your pockets, wonder how much you making and how much you doing. Man, you better cut them out. You better cut them out. I'm telling you, because they gonna leech that energy from them. They gonna leech financially from you, emotionally and all that. You gotta cut all that out, man. Keep your circle tight. I mean, real tight. Keep it so tight, like... <laughs> When you get the, when you meet, and don't get, don't be afraid to meet new people. What happens? You deal with toxic people, and from their actions, you end up scared to meet new people, man. Like since I've been traveling and doing different things and going different places and moving out of my environment, man, you meet so many new people that's real, and you're gonna meet some that's fake. But only the chosen few gonna um, know, you know, who's fake and who's real. Certain signs that um, will let you know if somebody's being real with you or authentically love you, man. You know what I'm saying? It's little signs. If you get that gut instinct, you be like, I don't know about this person, man. I really don't know. They doing a little shady shit or they coming at me sideways. Man, you got to um, cut them off. You got to cut them off. Or even if you don't cut them off fully, keep that in addition. Everybody got a, a different position to play in their life. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in your life isn't supposed to be close to you. You know what I'm saying? They supposed to be at a distance or, you know what I mean? But um, don't be afraid to open up to new people, new things, and... um. Wake up, man. Wake up. Because life is too short. You only live one life. One. I promise you that. I don't know everything in the world. But I can tell you you only live one of these things, man. So don't waste it stressing over no bullshit. 
Don't waste it down trying to um, please anybody. Please yourself. I don't care what they say about me. I, hey, they've been talking about me since, shoot, I don't even know, 2000, 2003, whatever. They've been talking trash about me, but you can't care. Do they pay your bills? Do they take care of your kids? You know what I'm saying? Do they do they further your career or elevate you? If they do all that, then maybe you might want to take that serious. But if not, man, hey, they for the birds, bro. They're they going to watch. They're going to watch my grind. They're going to watch my elevation. So um, y'all stay blessed up on this Friday. Have a good Friday. Um, Don't get too lit. You know what I mean? It's, another, it's a new day tomorrow. So um, just enjoy enjoy y'all time. Enjoy yourselves and all. Uh, have a beautiful day. And I'm going to let y'all enjoy this view over here at the beach that um I got going on right now. You feel me? What is this? So, you gotta enjoy it, man. You see that sun right there? That sun got all that energy, man. Why you over here fighting, man? People over here fighting over what, man? Life is too, look how beautiful this world is, man. Look how beautiful, all y'all want, sit around, play video games and play virtual reality, man. Look at life, this real right here, bro. This real right here. That's God up there. This the best game you can play right here. All you little gamers, man. Don't, don't get me wrong, man. I used to be on COD hard, mad, and all of it. Man, I cut I cut all them video games out. This the best game to play right here is life. Life is the best. like a big game of Monopoly. You got to enjoy it, man. Y'all enjoy it. And don't worry about what nobody think, man. Be yourself. Be you. Be true to yourself. Let them talk because they ain't going to say it in your face. I promise they won't say it in my face. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, just be yourself. Love y'all.